Salutations viewers, my name is Game Dame, and welcome back to Alan Wake. So now we're in a dream, and we're trying to go to Diver's Isle, and I think he's just having a dream about her. yet, it was more than that. It was the truth. A suppressed memory unearthed by the Andersons moonshot. Wait, am I like, okay, it's first person view right now. observer. This was the night Alice and I had arrived at Bright Falls. The night Alice had disappeared. I had a chance to find out what had happened. I remembered being surprised to see the cabin dark. Alice would have never Alice? turned the lights Alice. off. I remembered thinking I caught a glimpse of her form underwater, sinking into the darkness. <sighs> Diving after her was the last vague memory I had of that night. After that, the next thing I could remember was waking up behind the wheel of the crash car and finding the first pages of the manuscript. I couldn't find her in all that blackness. I must have thought she drowned. No, she was taken by the darkness. Alice. Jagger had Alice, Alice, and so she had me. I'd been easy prey. Look at the cabin. Is there someone in the window? Alice? Wait, no, she can't be there. Maybe she's inside. No, maybe you took her, you crazy old coot. I don't even know if that's a word, but if that's a word, then, then she, that's what she is. She dug her nails into my brain and used me. Made me her puppet. Yo, what a bitch. She must be here somewhere. Maybe upstairs in the study. Alice! Yes, that's where she is. You can apologize. Alice! You laugh at the whole thing together and put it Alice? behind you. She's not here. No. You were foolish to think so. No, she's dead. She drowned. You're wrong. No, she's no, alive. No. It's your fault your wife is dead. You are guilty. All she wanted was to help you right. You killed her. No, you killed her! Oh, hush. There's still hope. Cauldron Lake is a special place. Here, you have the power to change things. Well, yeah, because I'm the writer, so like she anything I write... Kind. I will tell you what to do. She might be able to have a chance to come back to life, which would be awesome. You crazy old right hag. Back. The story will come true, and all will be well again. She had Alice, and the manuscript was the ransom for her. What a bitch. I just have to write her back into the storyline. Yes. I'll write. I'll fix it. I'll bring her back. And this is where the manuscript started to come in. No, I wrote it. I remembered it all now. In the dark, I'd written for days, a week, almost a complete manuscript of a novel entitled Departure. Jagger had been my editor, whispering in my ear, making sure that the unfolding story would make her more and more powerful. I thought I was saving Alice. Even with the cobweb she put in my head, some part of me had been aware enough to write my escape into the story. To bring a light into the cabin to release me before I could finish. To interrupt the horror story before the ending, where darkness consumed everything and everyone. Zane was weak and far away, but I had written him into the story and his light had been enough to set me free. Is there you go. I'm here because it was the light to set you free. You must hurry. You know I will hear. It will be back soon. She stole the skin of my armor a long time ago. She looks so old. Poor Zane. I had woken up, confused and groggy. 
my mind consumed by darkness and fear. All I could do was to escape. But that didn't work out for you. Now did it. The week spent in the cabin had taken its toll. I was barely conscious and fading fast. Yeah, so your first idea was to get into the car. Perfect. Throw him even deeper into whatever dark place he now haunted. But he had managed to weaken the dark presence. Kept me safe that night. Don't get behind the wheel, kids, if you're tired. You're drunk or tired, doesn't matter. Never get behind the wheel. If you're inebriated in some way, shape, or form. It's my fault. That's right, James Joyce. It's your fault, and you're gonna pay for it. Oh, FBI have come to find me. But how could I have known it was my fault? Wow, end of episode four. I'm gonna skip this. Previously on Alan Wake. I wrote a horror story that is coming true. Dagger had been my editor, making sure that the unfolding story would make her more and more powerful. Some part of me had been aware enough to write my escape into the story. Goodness. We can create something absolutely wonderful. The lake, it does something to the works of art created here. It makes them come true. My mom gave me this old light switch. The clicker. Alice is being kept in a dark prison. I need to find Cynthia Weaver to fix this. It's your fault, and you're gonna pay for it. How is, some, how is something like this my fault? I mean, yeah, I created it, but I was under the influence of the darkness. A record crowd from the neighboring counties. Naturally, we hope to break the record set by last year's Moose Fest in our neighboring town, Watery. Ladies and gentlemen, Great. some people have asked me, what's the big deal about Deer Fest? And I think that this sums it up. It's about friendship and community. We've got a great party coming up, though. Uh, let's try to hold it in until tomorrow and get through the night in one piece, all right? I love it. Someone will come for it when the time is right. Thomas said so. He wrote it. The key is insurance. It's my job to keep it safe. Safe in the light. Always in the light. Always in the light. But there's not going to be enough light at this point. All the manuscript pages were gone. The FBI agent had taken them. I think... I think my tongue just took a crap in my mouth. That's what happens when you drink unknown substances. This is not good. That about some. No, but you're also balding, which. Nice. Good thing there's a drain in the middle. Oh, I am never drinking again. And that's what uh, everyone says, but they end up the drinking saw. again anyways. The lady of the light. What, the crazy lady? Ugh, whatever you say, what Al, but we're stuck here. Like They're not Shh. gonna. I had some reading to do first, Sheriff. And let me tell you, it was an interesting read. Well, I've got you now, Raymond Chandler. It's all here. All the evidence, including conspiracy to murder a federal agent. There's no way you're walking out of here. You hear me in there, Brett Easton Ellis? Why do you keep calling me all these different you know, names? Gail, I want to talk to your superior. Well, we all want things, Sheriff. I wanted my... <laughs> Look, that's not possible right now. Agent Nightingale, I insist. <sighs> she was taken to the house What's underneath. Wrong, lady? Are you stupid? It's a trick. It's an obvious trick. Okay, I've had enough of this crap. Wake, I'm gonna trust you with this. You're joking. Agent Nightingale, your opinion would matter more if you were sober and if I actually believed you were here on official business. Whoa! Get. <laughs> Get back in the cell, Stephen King. The only way you're leaving this place is over my dead. Wait a minute. I know. This. He read my manuscript. Oh my God. Light. We need light. It's the only way to fight this thing. In my office. I've got your things there. Follow me. Thank you. Oh, and we're sitting ducks with the lights out. 
Stay cool. I can get the emergency power on. This would ev this would give everyone a phobia of the darkness. This kind of situation. But no one believed me. Everyone thought I was boy who cried wolf. Now look who's in the darkness. Ja boy. Come on, open your door. Give me all my items. Wait, what do I need to know? What wow, you get I had I had a super heavy duty light. item. What are you talking Cynthia about? Here. She can help me stop this. Light. Check. Cynthia. She lives in the old decommissioned power plant. I can get you there pretty quickly in the rescue chopper. Come on. Thank what God. At least someone's on my side on this police force. Everyone else is just trying to out to get me. To stay here. What? No. We're going to fetch our ride, but I have friends who need to be warned about this, and I can't be in two places at once. I need your help. Well. Okay. When you put it like that, I can. I need you to call them and tell them. Obi Wan Kenobi, you're my own. Night Springs. You okay. have saved my life. <laughs> you are my only hope. Like the TV show? Gotcha. Oh, hey, that radio guy is on the list. Maybe. Oh, pick a flare. Check everywhere. Hey, that rhymes. Hey, is this like a secret society? You're my only hope, Barry. Barry Senpai. Please know that I'm only. All right. You'll come back for me though, right? Nope. As soon as we get the chopper ready. We aren't. I owe you one. Sorry. We aren't coming back for you. Okay. You coming? Through the back. I hope you're a better shot than that dude that I had to work with earlier. But of course, he was against me anyway, so he didn't want to be a great shot to begin with. Oh, hell. Whatever took Nightingale must have broken the gate controls. We can't reach the gate's control box from here. We need to get to the other side over the rooftop. I'll go. Hmm. I'll open the gate for you once I'm across. You stay here in the light and cover me, Sheriff, okay? Yeah, you better, girl. All right, where am I going? Ah. That's what I thought. Find a way to access the roofs. The rooftops. Oh, don't I just like... Yes, girl! Over here. Oh, Schneiser. Got this green goblin goop. Well, not green, but like black goblin goop over here. Of course, this goop's gonna be fucking everywhere. I swear to God, if I get more birds, I'm gonna throw something. I don't know if I can handle more birds. I really don't know if I can handle more birds, honestly. All right, well, I'm finding a way to the roof. Ooh, whoa, 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 whoa. In light, you can hurt them. Oh my god, really? I wouldn't have guessed. You're so smart. That's super cool of you to say. I'm not leaving unless every goop has been taken care of. Hmm. See, I would have landed in some goop. Some goblin goop, my boys. A uh, fucking horse. What did I say? Get out of here. Get out of here, my goodness. I fucking hate these birds. Nothing has made me more angry than that. 
Nice, and I follow my death, so I'm gonna have to go against those birds again. I will save that for the next episode, though. You'll see me raging against birds again. Thank God, because that's what all we all want to see, right? Birds, 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 birds. But hey, thanks so much for watching, guys. You guys have a fabulous day, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.